the percentage of fires that are due to electrical system issues is around 9%. And so the facility manager in charge of a, a larger commercial building, let's say, it must be quite unnerving to have, you know, potentially where there's alterations that have been made, changes that have been made, you know, what is the state of my electrical system? And what issues are, are lingering out there, which potentially may later become uh, fire issues or, you know, are there issues within the building that haven't been tested or evaluated? When fire service has to come during a potential emergency and we're trying to find where the issue is or try to locate the issue, we'll often want to just isolate that one particular area and that's where it becomes more, you know, tricky depending on the age of the building and the labeling on, on fuse panels or breaker panels. And it's nice your company is able to do that where potentially flush out or unveil those issues that might exist and to try to clean them up. So we would advocate you to eliminate any of your hazards that are there from an uh, electrical safety perspective and a fire safety perspective. We're all trying to be fiscally prudent these days. And, uh, you know, the sooner you can be more proactively dealing with issues tends to be that you're going to save yourselves money in the long run.